It's being called a major victory for self-driving cars. Cruise and Waymo got permission to expand driverless taxi service in San Francisco. That means starting immediately, their robo-taxis can operate 24-7 across the city and parts of San Mateo County. But as NBC Bay Area City of Quintana tells us, it's not yet clear when the general public will be able to book trips in one of those self-driving taxis. In some parts of San Francisco, driverless cars have already become a regular part of the scenery. And with the California Public Utilities Commission's decision to grant expanded robo-taxi permits to Cruise and Waymo, soon the rest of San Francisco will be able to pay for a ride in them. I think I'm in board, like on board with it. I think it's a, an improvement. Yeah, because I trust the technology here, so I think it's uh, safe and it's, uh, why not? Terrifying. Yeah, I've seen like six today. Um, the other night I was driving in the fog and they like didn't really know what to do. While the ruling means they can expand immediately, neither company has shared details on when they'll actually open their services to the general public. Both companies' apps have been available to download for a while now, but they're still operating on a wait list and invite only basis. Today, neither company has responded to our requests for more information. Cruise has already been operating robo-taxi service in a portion of San Francisco on a limited basis. Yesterday's more than 200 speakers sounded off for and against the self-driving cars during the California Public Utilities Commission meeting. Among those who oppose the expansion, the Northern California Teamsters Union. Teamsters are disappointed that the PUC uh, chose greedy tech corporations and their profits and robots over human beings, workers, drivers, our jobs, our safety, our communities. The Teamsters join members of the IBEW bus drivers union in opposition to the new robo taxi services. And now they're backing a proposed state law that would require a human safety operator to ride with any future autonomous big rig in the state. In San Francisco, Sergio Quintana, NBC Bay Area News.